everybody, welcome to our new video. Today we're gonna show you how to test packed meat in a vacuum chamber. We're gonna show you two ways to test this pack and see if it has any leaks. In our first test, we will place the pack inside the chamber and apply vacuum. Notice this meat is preserved in vacuum packing, but it still has some air inside. The CDV leak detector is powerful enough to create greater vacuum in the chamber than the one inside this vacuum packed meat. If this air starts leaking out in the form of bubbles, that means the package has a leak and therefore has failed this test. As a side note, when we apply vacuum to water, at a certain level it will start to form bubbles or boil. This can make bubble leak detection difficult because of all the bubbles in the water. As we apply vacuum, the package starts to swell up because of the difference in the pressure outside. In this case, there has been no leak from this package, so it passed. Next, we will use a needle and patch kit. This method helps to detect leaks in packages that are vacuum packed, but have very little or no air at all. First, we place a patch and needle so we can inject the air into the package inside the chamber. This method will not use vacuum, but rather positive air pressure inside the package. This test will not make the water boil in the chamber, and detection of any leak can be seen easily. We will need to inject air into the package during testing so we can see if any bubbles come out. The needle is connected to an air supply by means of a plastic tube. As the air flows into the package, we can see it swell inside the chamber. In this test, we have made a small opening on purpose so we can see what a leak looks like. As the air is injected through the needle and patch, bubbles are flowing out through the opening. Learn more about vacuum chambers and leak testing and hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to turn notifications on to see more of our videos. And please share.